Hey everyone, I'm Jake Cohen, and today we are with our friends at Handsome Brook Farms, and I'm going to show you one of my favorite breakfast treats. We're making a savory chive Dutch baby with bacon. So delicious. Let's get started. Gorgeous new packaging. So sleek. So handsome. There are not a ton of ingredients, which is why quality is so important. We're going to start off with four of our Handsome Brook Farms pasture-raised organic eggs. Honestly, these are our favorite eggs for so many reasons. The fact is, they got happy chickens. Each chicken has over 108 square feet of outdoor grazing, which is more than I can say about my New York City apartment. And let's talk quality. Like, we are all about pasture-raised organic eggs. Hansbrook Farms, like the land and the feed that they use, is certified organic, meaning no GMOs in the feed, no pesticides or chemicals, no antibiotics. These are just absolutely perfect, gorgeous, delicious eggs. To that, I'm going to add in three quarters of a cup of whole milk, quarter of a cup of chopped chives, and a half teaspoon of salt. I'm gonna cover this up and let's blend it together. Gonna add in three quarters of a cup of all-purpose flour. Just gonna blend this until it's incorporated. And that's it, that's our batter. Meanwhile, we are going to cook up some bacon. This is not only going to be the most wonderful garnish, but it's going to render out the fat that we use to cook the Dutch baby itself. So now that our bacon is in the pan, what I'm gonna do is I'm going to pop it into a 450 degree oven and cook it. Um, what we're doing here is kind of twofold. A, we're cooking our bacon. B, we're rendering out the fat into the pan that we're then gonna to use to cook our Dutch baby. Um, so I'm gonna pop this in. All right, let's get it into a 450 degree oven until it is crispy and rendered. This is what our beautiful crispy bacon looks like in just 13 minutes. I'm gonna put our bacon directly onto a paper towel lined plate just to drain. Now we are going to use this hot cast iron to cook our Dutch baby. So we have all this beautiful bacon grease. Don't get rid of it. I'm just going to swirl, make sure everything is coated. Um, if you feel like you had way, 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 way too much bacon grease, which is kind of what we have here, um, I'm gonna pour some off. We wanna leave two tablespoons in the pan. Add in our batter directly to the pan. We're gonna pop this straight back into the oven for about 20 minutes. While the Dutch baby cooks, let's fry up some eggs. I'm going to add in one tablespoon of our reserved bacon grease that I took out from the pan. I'm gonna heat this up over medium high heat. All right, to our hot bacon grease, I'm going to crack in two eggs. Beautiful, fresh eggs. Don't spread across the whole pan. I'm just frying up two because I love to kind of just mix them in. Uh, once you serve them on top, break that yolk, get it all covered on our Dutch baby, but you can also fry as many as you'd like. I'm actually gonna start basting the whites, so I'm gonna pull some of the grease right over the whites there. It's gonna help to set them. Oh my God, the smell of beautiful pasture-raised organic eggs, frying in bacon and grease. It's one of my favorite smells in the morning. Only is gonna take about two minutes. Be careful, they're gonna sputter a little bit, but that's just building up flavor. And there we go, perfectly beautiful fried eggs. We got crispy edges, we got yolks that are still nice and runny. Sunny side up dream. Okay, this beauty just came out, took 15 minutes. Look at that height we got, such a beautiful rise time to top and serve. All right, let's plate it up. I'm going to scatter my bacon right in the center. And then let's top it off with our eggs. Gorgeous. 
gorgeous. Finish with some chives, flaky salt. And we are ready to serve. Let's give it a try. Ooh, so fluffy, so great. We got that beautiful crispy bacon, that perfectly cooked, Ooh, handsome brook egg. Um, honestly, it's like, I have really high hopes for this dish. The combination of chives and bacon is just such a perfect, perfect match. Um, when you add in like, this beautiful, like bubbly, crispy crust, that super soft interior, these gorgeous eggs. You can taste that the chickens are happy and they're treated well. The fact is like pasture raised organic eggs is always the gold standard and Hansbrook Farms does such a great job, which is why we're so happy to feature them in this dish. Um, if you want the full recipe, you can head to thefeedfee.com and I'll see you next time.